I'm making a hammering robot because uh, I hate getting my nails done. <laughs> Actually, I've blacklisted a bunch of jokes for this project, including it's hammer time. Let's get hammer. Nailed it. Smashed it. Shaft. And I've also already built a hammering robot, but I forgot to film an intro. So let's rewind to before I knew how painful this project would be. I was so much younger back then. Oh wait, by the way, this video is sponsored by Squarespace. Thank you. Back to rewinding. Hi, my name is Simone. This is what I have so far. So here's a servo motor that I hope is gonna not buckle under the pressure of all of this. Oh, poor servo motor. Oh, why am I not a mechanical engineer? I feel like this would be so much easier if I just knew what I was doing. This is not gonna work out. I went back to the drawing board and made a bunch of sketches of it. I really need to make sure that this fully works very soon because I'm taking it to LA because they're gonna be a guest on Good Mythical Morning. I got a linear actuator, 560 pounds of thrust. <laughs> oh my God, it's so heavy too. So the main thing I struggled with mechanically for this project is that I want only to use one linear actuator, but I want the hammers to be offset so that they're not hammering at the same time, but they're going like this. But then I realized that if they have the same pivot point, but the the motor lifts them, one from, from this side and one from the back side, then we should get that effect. I've made so many assumptions in this, but I've also planned really carefully, so. <laughs> Oh my God, this is some hard wood. It's like impenetrable. <laughs> Scott is laughing. <laughs> so they're both gonna pivot right around here. And I have like these little D shafts that are going into the hole, but you need to make sure that they don't get stuck in the hole, <laughs> that they can twist around really well. I'm done. <laughs> so I have these bushings that you Come push on. into the hole. Oh, Bushing? <laughs> really? How? Like a bush? <laughs> we don't have an HR department. Also, we're hiring for an HR department. <laughs> Send your HR resumes ASAP yeah. to Scott at nothavingthis.com. I doubt this machine so much. We're just gonna try it. This is a really big motor and there's a lot of things that can go wrong, but okay. But thanks for watching. <laughs> Why is it so slow? But most of all, we need to make sure that it actually touches the table because now it's just like really politely <laughs> stopping. You're not supposed to be polite. You're supposed to look like a kid who's throwing a tantrum in a shopping mall. Okay, it's also really late. I need to eat some food and not hang out with this hammering robot more. I'll show you how to be angry. Ah! Okay, this is where it's at. It's just not working out. And I was really stubborn trying to make it work with the linear actuator and Marcos was helping me out. <laughs> the guy is polishing a rod. Marcos is, is my friend who helped me build spool. I think I showed him briefly polishing the needle to spool as well. Well, you just gotta embrace that that's your brand on my YouTube channel now. <laughs> I'm flying to LA tomorrow and we basically started building the hammering robot from scratch, but I like this so much more. I've scrapped the linear actuator. I might do like a DIY hydraulic press with it or something. Basically, it's just gonna be here and the motor is gonna have a cam and it's gonna push down on the, on the hammer and then it's gonna hammer, hammer stuff. You'll see, it's gonna be glorious. I'm gonna weld for the first time in my life. Yeah! Bulk, bulk, bulk. So you're gonna come like this? Yes. You're gonna steady your hand with your glove? Yes. Be real stable with the tip. Hold off, wait until we're ready. Yeah, I know, I am. Ah, yeah! <laughs> 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 I'm sorry. 
I got you. Ow! <laughs> Marcus is like, watch it, it's warm. I'm like, I know. <laughs> it was worth it. I want to feel my well. Good mystical morning. I'm nervous because Marcus and I finished this robot 10 p.m. yesterday and there's like 80 people here. So if it doesn't work, I'm gonna be the one sweating. Yeah. This is Simone Yetch and she has built a hammering robot. We are gonna build a birdhouse, by the way. Just That's like this. Really hopeful. So what's really great about this hammering robot is that you only need three people to operate it. <laughs> Gotta get out of there quick. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna up the stick a little bit. Yeah, really. Ah! It got it in a little bit. Yo! What did you think about the robot? Uh, it does, it does its thing very well. Very dangerous, very edgy. I feel like it might be better as a smashing robot or as like a beat robot. Yeah. It did I, get a good like. That's kind of what I was. Yeah. That's what I was considering its thing, but I didn't want to hurt your feelings. I'm going to take it and smash some stuff. Back to San Francisco. Some help with that? No, I got it. See ya. Bye. Thanks. Oi. Oh wow, it's uh, it's now again, just like in the beginning of the video. I'm actually not looking at an imaginary wristwatch, I'm just seeing how much my arm hair has grown. <laughs> the hammering robot is definitely more destructive than constructive. I wanted to embrace its true nature. Can we cue some triumphant music? Is that, is that all we can afford? Yeah, okay. We'll be triumphant on a budget. Don't put the hammering robot in a mold because it will break it. If you put a glass ceiling over the hammering robot, it will shatter it. You can try and knock the hammering robot down, but it will knock you out. Is anyone else crying? Or is it just me? <laughs> is that how you work tears? <laughs> this is how I work tears. I try and just push them back into the eyeball. Should I be wearing shoes maybe? Safety first. But I don't call it safety, I call it sexy. <laughs> okay, uh, let yourself free, hammering robot. Mark, I don't know what the story behind making this car is, but the story's gonna end here. <laughs> I love you. Apparently they didn't love you back. They gave it to Goodwill. <laughs> uh, We still have a whole head. Are you okay, Scott? Yeah, a foot flew out and hit me in the elbow. <laughs> <laughs> There's very few contexts that sentence would make sense. They put the switch in the box. That is not an accident. Somebody had a good time making that. No. <laughs> I'm like, this is making me feel really bad. Totally rooting for the dog to get away. <laughs> You're rooting for the dog to get away? <laughs> We cannot kill this dog. I'm gonna spare you, I'm so sorry. Does anyone want this dog? We'll send it out to somebody on Patreon. You're gonna get a second chance in life. I didn't kill the dog, but I did kill the mood. See you later, calculator.
For anyone who's wondering, this is how I do my tax returns. Oh no, it's like it's bleeding. <laughs> this is what I picture whenever anyone writes me in caps lock. Incoming sponsored message. Are you upset with your computer? Is your website not working right? Squarespace is an all-in-one platform where you can build your website. They have domains, online stores, really nice looking templates. Don't break your computer. Go to squarespace.com for a free trial and when you're ready to launch, squarespace.com slash Simone gets you 10% off. You know what my arm hair is telling me? That it's hammer time. Let's get hammered. Let's get smashed! Nailed it! Let's get my nails done! Punch me! That was not a part of the blacklist. You inspired me, hammering robot. <laughs>